I read Claiborne Park during one of our season selection meetings and I finished it, I closed it and I said, we need to do this show. And it's one of the funniest plays I've read in a long time, while also being one of the most fiercely provocative plays that I've read in a long time. And let's imagine if the tables were turned. Suppose a number of white families started marching into their community. Well, that might actually be to your advantage. One of the themes of the show is institutional racism and how that uh, works in our society, just showing that it's, it's not any necessarily, it's not because you feel racist about somebody. It's not because you don't like someone because they're black or they're Hispanic or they're white or they're, Japanese, um, it's, it's when those things actually get stuck into law that you can't fight against that. Claiborne Park really deals with what does it mean to be a community and what does it mean to be in community with each other. That's a big thing in this play is to, is understanding situations to understand one another. For Christ's sake, what do you think happens in a goddamn war? Clyburn Park is so multi-layered. It has a lot of different themes, but for me it boils down to the differences between people. The differences or reasons that we might not really understand each other, or reasons that we might use to treat each other differently. Um, race, but not just race, gender, wealth, uh, sexual identity, disability, education, um, all the levels that we use to stratify our society. And Clyburn Park uses all of those. Clyburn Park. It's not about a park, it's about a place. A community is dealing with race and gentrification. Want an explanation? Then come and see this show open one of these days. Hey! <laughs> 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 <laughs>